For all the light and heat the sun provides the Earth, the largest star in the middle of our solar system remains in many ways a mystery. It's one of those things that we're like, we've got the sun. We see the sun every day. We must know everything about the sun already. But really, we don't. Um, and we're using cutting-edge technology right now to, to send something that close to the sun. Liftoff of the mighty Delta IV heavy rocket with NASA's Parker Solar Probe. In 2018, NASA launched the Parker Space Probe, an ambitious spacecraft scientists first dreamed of 60 years ago. Actually, that's not entirely accurate. Astronomers have been studying the sun for centuries, but the only time they could look closely at it was during solar eclipses. They could only dream of a declaration this bold. We have finally arrived. Humanity has touched the sun. Now, the sun doesn't have a solid surface. It's a giant ball of hot plasma that's held together by its own gravity. The wispy lines of solar material that are contained within the sun's magnetic field are called the corona, and that's what the Parker probe flew through. You can imagine the response from people who've dedicated their lives to capturing these images. Is, is that the Milky Way passing? Uh, yeah, absolutely. The that's the Milky Way. Yes. It's amazing. That is extraordinary. Yeah. Thank you. Of all the sun's wonders, NASA is honing in on two. They want to know why the corona is 300 times hotter than the surface of the sun. And they want to better understand how solar winds work because they can disrupt satellites and fry electrical grids here on Earth. And what we don't often think about is, you know, the phone that we easily have in our hands to check TikTok, to watch the news, to check the weather app. All of this is really operated by satellites. The tragedy of a potential TikTok outage aside, the sun is the only star we know that supports life. So perhaps we should spend more time appreciating it. Mike Drolight, Global News, Toronto.